Hey there everyone, how's it going? Shire Mr. Fees here with M Digital Gaming. It's been a hot minute since the last time I uploaded a video. Now that Halloween is over and spooky month is over, we're going right back into playing Halo and classic first person shooters. And I'm going to start with a full 6 hour, 59 minute walkthrough of Halo 2 Anniversary Edition. And if you guys have been watching the multiple parts, a lot of you guys requested that I re-upload all of them into one huge long video. So thank you for the good feedback. Nevertheless, I will be uploading a lot of different new content going forth for November. So hopefully you guys stick around, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell. Nevertheless, we're going to get started here in a bit. And you're going to just hear my voice in the first hour or so recording all this sweet, sweet gameplay. And... Without further ado, I want to hear from you guys in the comments below if you like these long videos. If not, keep it to yourself. If so, what's the next ha game I should cover? And besides Halo, Halo 3 and Halo DST is out now. And pretty soon Halo 4 is going to be coming. So nevertheless, I'm just going to let the gameplay go on. Let my soothing voice come in and basically record. I'll see you guys in the next one. trust you. He may, but I do not. Noted. My friend's trust is not the issue today, Spartan Lock. It is my trust you must earn. Armor. <laughs> you are a hunter, yes. A seeker of things. That's not the official job title, but it's close enough. And now you hunt other Spartans. I'm not so much hunting a Spartan, as I'm hunting the Spartan. You seek... One, one, seven. I was not told the identity of your prey. That is why I'm sharing it with you now. We're talking about trust, after all. May I ask you something? Your people used to call him demon. Was that an insult? or a compliment. An insult, to be sure, but one with a modicum of respect. He was indeed my enemy, but in time, I named him ally, even friend. The events which forged this bond were complicated. Well, admittedly, from my memory, oh, okay, another cutscene. Now these cutscenes look amazing, I believe Blur Studio, which is the guys that make those CG trailers, were the ones behind this. So, I mean, gosh, it's, it's amazing. If only games look like that. There was only one chip. One? Are you sure? Yes. They called it the Pillar of Autumn. Why was it not destroyed with the rest of their fleet? It fled as we set fire to their planet. But I followed with all the ships in my command. When you first saw Halo, were you blinded by its majesty? Blinded? Paralyzed? Dumbstruck? No. Yet the humans were able to evade your ships, land on the sacred ring, and desecrate it with their filthy footsteps. Noble hierarchs. Surely you understand that once the Parasite attacked... There will be order in this council! You were right to focus your attention on the Flood. But this demon, this Master Chief... By the time I learned the demon's intent... There was nothing I could do. <laughs> Noble Prophet of Truth, this has gone on long enough. Make an example of this bungler. The Council demands it. You are one of our most treasured instruments. Long have you led your fleet with honor and distinction. But your inability to safeguard Halo was a colossal failure. Hey, it was heresy. I will continue my campaign against the humans. No! You will not. 
Soon the great journey shall begin. But when it does, the weight of your heresy will stay your feet, and you shall be left behind. was about to fail. There's viscosity throughout the gel layer. Optics, totally fried. And let's not even talk about the power supply. You know how expensive this gear is, son? Tell that to the Covenant. Ooh, catchy one-liner. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Well, I guess they added in a new cutscene. I don't remember Spartan Lock being in Halo 2 or any of the any any of the past iterations to be honest um all right here we are well, oh wow i guess it was all obsolete anyway your new suit's a mark six just came up from songnam this morning try and take it easy until you get used to the upgrades okay let's test your targeting first thing please look at the top light good Boop. now look at the bottom light all Boop. right look at the top light again that's Boop. it now the bottom one okay okay Tracking looks sketchy. I'm going to run you through the full diagnostic. The diagnostic software sets your targeting system to be normal. Oh, wow. This Go is how you used to look, look like back on lights, Xbox? Chief. You have to look at each light until it turns green. You want me to leave it like that or make it inverted? I'm going to go with normal. I can't play inverted. If you change your mind, you can switch the setting anytime. Stand by. I'm going to offline the inhibitors. Move around a little. Get a feel for it. When you're ready, come meet me by the zapper. Oh, wow. So, if you guys remember, this is how it looked like on Xbox. I've been looking at this with rose-colored... Tinted... Take it easy. What do you call it? Rose-colored glasses? Is that what the term is? Careful, you'll tear a tendon doing that. Pay attention, because I'm only going over this once. This station will test your recharging energy shields. Step on in, I'll show you. Okay. Your new armor shields are extremely resilient, very efficient. Much better than the Covenant tech we use for the Mark V. Go ahead and use the switch in front of you to start the shield test. Just place your hand on the touchpad to activate the switch. So basically, when you press tab on PC, I don't know if on Xbox, on Anniversary you Edition, you basically, yeah, I'm listening, Hit no problem. <laughs> In a second, let me see, I'm talking. <laughs> uh, it, it looks, you can press tab and it just goes back to the oh, original yeah, engine. Switch in front of you. So when I press tab again, it looks like this. It, gosh, this looks amazing. Whee! Bingo! As you can see, they recharge a lot faster. That's amazing. And then there's Sergeant Johnson. If shields go down, find some cover, wait for the meter to read fully charged. That, or he can hide behind me. Huh, he you sounds a little bit different. Here, Master Guns. I don't see any training wheels. His armor's working fine, Johnson, so shut your chilly hole. <laughs> You're free to go, son. Just remember, take things slow. Don't worry, I'll hold his hand. So, Johnson, when are you going to tell me how you made it back home in one piece? Sorry, Guns. It's classified. <laughs> My ass? Well, you can forget about those adjustments to your A2 scope. Well, he's in a particularly fine mood. Yeah. Maybe Lord Hood didn't give him an invitation. I'm wondering how... I just recently played Combat Evolve, and last time I remember he was on the planet. Yeah. Haven't seen it in years. Well, we have been in cryo sleep for like how many years? The basic. The orbital defense grid was all theory and politics. Now look, the Cairo is just one of 300 geosync platforms. That Mac gun can put around clean through a Covenant capital ship. Which one is it again? It's been so long since I've delved into the lore of Halo. Fire from the Athens and the Malta. Nothing's getting past this battle cluster in one piece. It's amazing. Detail in this game is amazing, She's like... Been all morning. Nobody's saying much, but I'll 
something big's about to happen. Yeah, something big is gonna happen, Sergeant Johnson. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, so that wasn't there. Okay, now another cutscene, I guess. It's interesting that they replace all the in-game cutscenes with uh, uh, CGI, Blur Studio cutscenes. You told me you were gonna wear something nice. Folks need heroes, Chief. To give them hope. Oh, so you can press tab and go to the original cutscene and then go to the CGI one. That's interesting. I'll probably do the... You know, I'll quiet down and let you guys enjoy that CGI. Sir, near Io, we have probes en route. Uh, I apologize, but we're going to have to make this quick. You look nice. Thank you. <laughs> Sergeant Major, the Colonial Cross is awarded for acts of singular daring and devotion for a soldier of the United Earth Space Corps. There can be no greater heresy. Let him be an example for all who would break our covenant. Commander Miranda Keyes, your father's actions were in keeping with the highest traditions of military service. His bravery in the face of impossible odds reflects great credit upon himself and the UNSC. The Navy has lost one of its best. directly off our battle cluster. Show me. Fifteen Covenant Capital ships holding position just outside the kill zone. This is Fleet Admiral Harper. We are engaging the enemy. Negative, Admiral. Form a defensive perimeter around the cluster. Commander, get to your ship. Link up with the fleet. Yes, sir. You have the mech gun, Cortana. As soon as they come in range, open up. Gladly. Something's not right. The fleet that destroyed Reach was 50 times this size. Sir, additional contacts. Boarding craft and lots of them. They're going to try to take our Mac guns offline. Give their capital ships a straight shot at Earth. Master Chief, defend this station. Yes, sir. I need a weapon. Right this way. So this is interesting. Pressing tab makes you go back to the original engine and back to this. This is fun. SMG, gonna go duoly. I remember this being such an amazing thing back in the original day. Check your targets, watch the crossfire. They're in standard formation. Little bastards up front, big ones in back. Alright. So they've docked. Remember that being a cutscene thing. This game highly relied on relied on uh, what's it called? In-game cutscenes and that 
Half-Life 2 feeling because Half-Life had come out not too long ago. Half-Life 2, I can't remember when it came out. I was a kid when all these games came out. Open fire! I only have one bullet left. Oh shoot, there's a guy behind me. What's the map? Am I coming on too soon? Oh shoot, I'm sorry, I didn't mean that. Oh, he went bouncing. Oh, my bad. <laughs> it's, this game is way too dark to see anything. Anyways, going on. Oop, been spotted. Not a big issue, right? Yeah, playing this game on Legendary is quite different from what I remember it to be. A little unforgiving. Oh god. Oh no 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 <laughs> Where'd he go? Oh I got him down. Nice. Sugar water. I got another contact. Oh okay. He said something else. Sugar water. That's hilarious. <clears throat> Excuse me. Straining my voice here today. Water's fine. Alright, saluted. Oh, and did a little, little teabag thing. Hooray! Find the border's contact. point of entry, Chief. Cut them off at the source. Oh, that melee comes in handy. I have to go that way. Oh, this, this looks amazing. I just can't help Chief, but we don't take out go into the... Craft, they'll just keep, sending reinforcements. keep pressing tab and just checking what they've changed and what they've kept in the game. I did this a couple times in my... Combat Evolved, Combat Evolved, um, uh, gameplay. It's nice to see some things never change though. <laughs> that guy was just running into the door. Oh, I was right, I had to go this way. Okay, that grenade got rid of. Nope, there's one more. Man, they go flying. Love this new engine that they got going. Okay, and I remember that close. Opens up. Malta, what is your status? Over. I don't believe it! They're retreating! We won! Oof. So much for saying you won. This is bad. Real bad. Would you call me? like sissy called me a sissy what the heck that ain't cool this 
got to be accurate, you know? Oh, okay. Oh, no, no, I got sticky. I thought I got stick stuck right there. Oh, he was just back there. Must have been low already. What the heck? He's <laughs> just trying to escape me. Wee. Uh oh. Hey, they're leaving the Athens. No, oh, dear. That's another one down. Cortana, assessment. That explosion came from inside the Athens. Same as the Malta. The Covenant must have brought something with them a bomb. Then they Ooh. sure as hell brought one here. Chief, find it. Chief, do everything. <laughs> New contact! Hey guys, I forgot to give you this earlier. Oh, Going through the other way. You guys clear out that way. Yeah. Let them up oh, like Christmas trees. the room oh uh, he's dead the guy that gave me my armor is dead rest in peace my dude oops playing this on legendary so I gotta keep it I don't mind, I'll keep reminding myself that. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh, that's great, I'm stuck in a pinch. That's what I'm talking about. Oh no, that grenade went past the guy. Oh, that didn't stick. Okay. I forgot if I'm on a timer or not. Oh shoot. Oh no 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 no! <laughs> Down you go. Yeah, there we go. Get back to the... The main. Wow, this is just amazing. You just want to like take a look. Second to like see how it looks. Oh, you can see actual textures on the window. I don't know if that's going to show up on YouTube. Come on, Chief, this way. Right, Sergeant Johnson on board when they show and Halsey. Don't worry, ma'am. We're on it. 
what's up here? I never bothered to check what's up here. I guess this is where they came Thanks, from. Chief. I owe you one. <laughs> Don't mention it. <laughs> Tries to sound cool and starts coughing. <laughs> Wow, this is amazing. Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to go this way. Not a lot of time on the clock, Chief. I get it, I get it. <laughs> oh, what was that? <laughs> Oh, that guy just went flying. There's a guy above me flying around. I can see him on the map. No, I can't go that way anymore. We. Oh, and down he goes. Yeah, you fall in space still in Halo, apparently. <laughs> oh, there's another day. Do it over there. Sir, borders have breached the fire control center. They have a bomb. Can you defuse it? Yes, but I'll need the chief's help to make contact with the detonator. Right, I'm almost chief, out of ammo again. The bomb, double time. Cortana, Never prioritize time. targets and fire at will. Alright, there we go. First echelon, you're with me. Blanket those cruisers. Take them out one by one. Second echelon, keep those carriers busy. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I, I totally forgot that happens. I'm going loud. I totally forgot that shotguns don't reach that far in this game. That scared me, not gonna lie. This guy is just coming out of nowhere. I'm supposed to go down there? Try to head head glitch a little. All right. Where's this going? Where's this going? Okay. Wow, there's so many moving parts to this game. I realized it. Oh man, I keep running out of ammo. I keep forgetting that this is legendary mode. Legendary mode. Let's see. Switch it out for that. 91 shots. That's all I need. This is the longest elevator ride, I think, if I can remember. I have fond memories of playing this game, but, you know, looking at it with rose-colored glasses. Oh, these are, these are ODST, ODST characters. I don't remember them being in the original game. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna have to switch back to my other game. Oh, getting lit up again. It's one down. The first carrier completely ignored us, sir. Blew through the Malta's debris field and headed straight for Earth. Okay, so they already got a boarding party on Earth right now. That's interesting. Is 
such an interesting map. Caution. Wow, look at that. Look at that scale. And if you made it this far, you guys should leave a comment. Let me know if you've enjoyed my commentary so far. I don't know. I'm not really good at this, to be honest. How far are we into this? I should have kept a timer on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the heck? Just so you know, there are quite a few elites guarding the bomb. You may need to get creative. All right. We're going to have to get into this. Oh shoot, didn't forget. Even when I was 12, I, or how old was I when this game came out? I'm gonna have to look at that up and put it up on the screen. This last guy right here. You're going down, you're going down. Teabag. <laughs> oh no, there's another guy. Stay down. And cutscene. Me inside your head now. time was left you don't want to know Cairo this is an amber clad the carrier shield is down I'm in position and ready for immediate assault negative commander not against a ship that size not on your own sir permission to leave the station for what purpose master chief to give the covenant back their bomb permission granted <laughs> love this part so much I'm gonna have to play this game on classic with, again, like maybe in the future, just just to see what they've changed. Like I know I've said that already, but oh man. I know what you're thinking, and it's crazy. So, stay here. Unfortunately for us both, I like crazy. <laughs> she likes crazy, but everyone knows who's a fan of the games. <laughs> she goes crazy in the future installments. <laughs> a spoiler alert. You didn't know. So cool, so badass, so edgy. Still want to build a Master Chief costume. Sick. Are so beautiful to look at. For a brick, he flew pretty good. Chief. Get inside. Gear up. We're taking this fight to the surface.
Sketchy. Any idea what it means? Dear humanity, we regret being alien bastards. We regret coming to Earth. And we most definitely regret the Corps just blew up our raggedy ass fleet. Hoorah! Regret is a name, Sergeant. The name of one of the Covenant's religious leaders, a prophet. He's on that carrier, and he's calling for help. <laughs> Kilo 2-3 is hot. Recommend mission abort. Roger, Recon. It's your call, Sarge. We're going in. Get tactical, Marines! Mr. Chief, get aboard that carrier. Secure the Prophet of Regret. This is the only place on Earth the Covenant decided to land. That Prophet is going to tell us why. Whoa. They didn't know we're here before. They do now. Keep it together, man. Here they come. A high.
My girl's a little big for that courtyard, Sergeant. I see there. a good LZ on the other side of these buildings. Meet you there. Over. Copy that. Someone get a sack on the gate. I need you on that bird. Yeah. My Pelicans are going to start airlifting armor and reinforcements to the city. They'll need an escort that isn't afraid of a little hostile ground fire. Understood. I'll keep an eye on them. Chief, good luck. I punch it, mate.
Crash site's on the other side of this hotel, Chief. Covered are crawling all over it. Follow me. concentration of coveted troops is directly below the carrier. I don't think they want you to get on board. That bridge is the most direct route to the city center. Oh man, I love the beach. I hope you packed a suit, mate. Cut the chatter. We got trouble.
this tunnel links up to the bridge. It's full of rats, if you know what I mean. But it beats swimming. the Covenant tactical chatter. They're surprised, confused. I don't think they expected us to be here. Not you and me. All of us. Humanity on Earth. Odd, I know, but it does help explain why they came here with such a small fleet. Don't let them.
Hey there everyone, how's it going? We're back with a Halo 2 walkthrough. I know in the last video, my audio setup cut out so you guys had to enjoy the video without me speaking. Needless to say, I think I fixed my audio issues. So we're gonna get right back into Halo 2. We are now, I believe, in the Metropolis section part of the game. Can't remember. Probably gonna load it up. together because you're going with it what about that scab we all run the simulations they're tough but they ain't invincible stay with the master chief you'll know what to do yes sir sergeant thanks for the tank he never gets me anything oh i know what the ladies like <laughs> sir johnson's the best also oh, tank level we got that dude and got that chick on our side. Let's do this. Oh, I don't know if you guys saw that. If you can see that. No more ghosts. No more ghosts. This is going to be interesting. Oh, it just blew up. I was like, what is that sound? Oh, man. Oh man, there's so many of them just coming in. I gotta back it up a little bit. Just a tad bit. You got a snake. Sorry, snake. What do you call him? Scarab? No, that's not what a scarab is. Got a little tank. I think I blew it up. I think it's done for. Yeah. Incoming. 
All right, you guys got it. Yes. Surprisingly, the AI is pretty pretty all right. Oof. My bad. Usually when I used to play this game, I'd probably lose all the, the marines on both sides of my tank by now. But, you know, that's going pretty good. Oh, look. I'm, there's a guy. Huh. Oh, shoot. He just ran into it. Ran into my tank. What the heck? What the heck? Banshee. Oh no, both my marines died out of nowhere. What the heck? That was random. Oh shoot, there's another one. <laughs> That's one thing I love about modern day games is that you can see the shadow of things. Look at the scale of this map. It's amazing. Oh, you know when the music kicks in, <laughs> everything's getting serious. <laughs> Halo will always have like a heart, place in my heart with music scores because, gosh, nothing comes close. Nothing has ever come close in my opinion. I mean, you yeah, have other games. You just got to be playing it in order to feel that nostalgia, but man. Oh shoot. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> I can't dodge that. Uh. That was close. Ooh, we got wrecked. <laughs> Goodbye, Banshee. Tank's not doing too good. It's on fire. I don't think I can take another shot, maybe. We're almost at the end of the bridge, though. Quite a welcome That's right. There's another Banshee. Lead my shot. Do I have to lead my shots? I can't remember. There's another Banshee. Ooh, <laughs> look at his spin. These physics, they're awesome. A banshee's still spinning up there. Oh, there's a ghost right in front of me. Didn't notice him. There's another one. And another one. Down you go. Reach the checkpoint. Awesome. Oh, more banshees. <laughs> Look at the flip. Whee. Oh, no. I don't have the health. There's two of them. I get I'm playing this on legendary. Okay, there he is. Oh, just ran over that banshee like it was nothing. What did he call these vehicles? I can't remember. If you know, comment in the, in the comments below. Oh, my Halo lore and knowledge isn't that up on par. I just know that Master Chief is a cool space boy. A thick boy in space who takes on it. So that's all I know. That's one of the hero games. From that 7th generation, 6th generation era of consoles. Gosh, I gotta admit, this looks beautiful. Look at that. The light, the ambient inclusion, flames. Yeah. That's awesome. Reached another checkpoint. Oh, look, a warthog. <laughs> Did 
just amazing to see AI, how far it's come for games and such. Okay, they're handling it. Guess they gotta get out here, huh? You guys gonna get in? It's tight quarters on the other side, sir. Use this. Thanks, man. All right, thanks, person. Gonna get into that warthog. Now imagine this was an RTX title, you know, real-time ray tracing and stuff. Let's flip this back over. You guys gonna get in or not? I don't think so. Alright, I think this level's designed not to be... Yeah, I think it's a foot level. I can't remember. Down. No. Ooh, someone's attacking me. Ah, red. Gotta take cover. Oh, no. Ammo. I'm getting lit up. Need a new ammo. Oh, you can go down. That's kind of interesting. Which way do I go? That's not definitely a lot of way through. Seems pretty atmospheric, you know. Games back then used to have like a. Uh, Really nice atmospheric nature to them. Imagine this being an RTX title though, like. But I love how much trickery they had to do just to get those shadows and everything and such. Okay, who's with me? <laughs> Oof, I didn't realize this had a cooldown. Okay, there are those two go. Yeah. Down. It's like a warthog running around down there. This is amazing to look at. Like, look at that guy. Look at him go. Let's see if we can snipe him out of his. Yep, there we go. One shot, one kill. That's what I'm talking about. Let's see if we can take one of these. Go see boys and get out of here. Alright, we can get on. I mean, if you have me, I'm just running off. He's like, I can use you on, on the turn, chief. And then he just runs off. Oh, sick. Oh, shoot. That almost hit me. Ouch. Got allies running around. Oh no. 
That's like my fifth death while playing Le Legendary. Oh. Oh no. Cool guy. And he's down. Out for the count. Oh. Can't afford to get hit one more time. How is he not blown up yet? Okay, there we go. Now I need to get rid of this guy. How are these guys back here? And that was an Oh no. Oh dear. I'm out of ammo. Let's see if I can hijack this. of this. Oh man, I just destroyed my only ride. Okay, that, yeah, that's not friendly. Okay, so these are called rates. Oh my gosh, I didn't know this things had boosts. <laughs> nice. Done. I wasted my grenades for that. That's kind of dumb. I just gotta. You know, I think that can fit in there. Okay, got one more guy on there. I should get him. There's one more guy over there. Let me see if I can run him over him. I'll just blow him up. Let's see if we can fit in there. Barely. Oh no. Use the boosts. Get the boosts in there. Nice. Awesome. Now we got him through. We started with the tank and now we got a different tank. I should get rid of him. Okay, now where do I go? Oh shoot. I heard like an explosion. I guess I'll just follow the Warthog. Look at this art design in this game. It was amazing. There are a number so of good. Trapped in that building. Concentrate on the rape. They're the biggest threat. Ooh, my bad. I just blew up those Marines. So many rates. I'm getting lit up. I can't take one more shot. I'm getting my overshields back on. I'm slowing down kind of. I right, want these guys. Alright, that should get rid of them. For the time being. Hope to bring down another scarab or tank. That got rid of him. What's in there? I wonder. All right, we got some more. All right, let's do this. Company, CP's this way. The lieutenant got hit as soon as we dropped in. Push on Who's in charge now, Corporal? Uh, Sergeant Banks, ma'am. He's up top. Come on, I'll show you. All right, let's get this thing over with. 
Ooh, a health crate. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at that. Reinforcements. I didn't think they'd send a spark. We got trouble. Yeah, that tank has no not See, this looks in terror. Green, I give you permission to Not sure what I'm supposed to do. But I don't feel like that's a safe spot to stand. Oh shoot, that's, this is not a safe spot to stand. I forgot. <laughs> okay, I guess he's just gonna be blocked that way. And just sit there. Okay. So we'll jump up that way. Okay, I remember playing this back in high school when like our video game club got had donated someone had donated a Xbox. Uh, to our video game club, and we were playing Halo 2 just all day long. This is like well after the Halo generation. Okay, I'm gonna need one of these. And one of these. I remember, I forgot. I totally missed the jump. Oh, I don't have any. Oh, he just jumped off. I can't tell you how many times we died. Back off a little bit. I'm out of ammo. Almost out of ammo. Try no scoping. There you go, no scoped. Oh. He just rushed out of nowhere. Oh, shoot. Okay, now we gotta destroy it. Oh no, there's more than... Careful, Chief. That elite was an ultra. Those pilots are no pushovers, either. Ultra. So that explains why it took him forever to die. Down you go. Just gotta hit him in the back, right? And there we go. Oh man, I don't remember this being in the game. It's like a whole sig decimated. Well, thank you for sticking around. I guess I'm going to end the video right here. I'll catch you guys in the next one. If you made it this far, and if you haven't hit that subscribe button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one.
Hey there everyone, how's it going? Shar Mr. Fees here. We are back with another installment of playing Halo 2 on with the Master Chief Collection on PC. Today we are in the Arbiter chapter. I believe this is when we finally get to play as Keith David's voice protagonist, the Arbiter. How much further must we heft this baggage? Any cell will do? Why not toss it in with this lot? They could use the meat. Them? What about us? My belly aches. And his flesh is seared just the way I like it. Quiet! You two will be like grunts fresh off the teak. He's not meant for the jails. The hierarchs have something special in mind. And take your brutes with you. Release the prisoner. The Council decided to have you hung by your entrails and your corpse paraded through the city. But ultimately, the terms of your execution are up to me. I am already dead. Indeed. Do you know where we are? The mausoleum of the Arbiter. Quite so. Here rests the vanguard of the great journey. Every arbiter from first to last. Each one created and consumed in times of extraordinary crisis. The taming of the hunters, the grunt rebellion. Were it not for the arbiters, the covenant would have broken long ago. Even on my knees, I do not belong in their presence. Halo's destruction was your error, and you rightly bear the blame. But the council was overzealous. We know you are no heretic. This is the true face of heresy. One who would subvert our faith and incite rebellion against the High Council. Our prophets are false. Open your eyes, my brothers. They will use the faith of our forefathers to bring ruin to us all. The great journey is a- This heretic and those who follow him must be silenced. Their slander offends all who walk the path. What use am I? I can no longer command ships, lead troops into battle. Not as you are, no. But become the Arbiter. And you shall be set loose against this heresy with our blessing. What of the Council? The tasks you must undertake as the Arbiter are perilous, suicidal. You will die as each Arbiter has before you. The Council will have their corpse. What would you have your Arbiter do? When we joined the Covenant, we took an oath. According to our station, all without exception. On the blood of our fathers, on the blood of our sons, we swore to uphold the Covenant. Even to our dying breath. Those who would break this oath are heretics, worthy of neither pity nor mercy. Even now, they use our Lord's creations to broadcast their lives. We shall grind them into dust and continue our march to glorious salvation. The 
This armor suits you, but it cannot hide that mark. Nothing ever will. You are the Arbiter, the will of the Prophets. But these are my elites. Their lives matter to me, yours does not. That makes two of us. Hmm. So this is interesting. Like I said, this uh, character is... Ooh, purple heads-up display. I don't know where to go. This guy. So this is interesting. I ne Like I said, I never played Halo 2 properly when I was a kid. All I played was the multiplayer portion at my cousin's house. And a few times I did play it was... Uh, and my high school's video game club when someone had donated the X a, a free Xbox to the club. This looks amazing. So I never knew that there was a second part, a second category to these characters, and it feels interesting to be playing as these elites. For the longest time, I always thought these were called Arbiters, but it turns out Arbiter is a title. Like I said, I'm not up to brush with my Halo lore. I'm just gonna hang back behind this little buddy over here. Engage active camouflage. Reveal yourselves only after the Arbiter has joined battle with the enemy. Okay. You may I... wish to do the same, Arbiter. But oh, okay. Heed. Your armor system is not as new as ours. Your camouflage will not last forever. Oh, well, that sucks. I think I could have gone stealth on this one. I had, I know Combat Evolved had a light stealth mechanic. Oh, shoot. my armor, my overshit or whatever it's called for the elites is down. All right, we're back at it again. All right, he's down. Oh, we got one more guy down there, probably. Nope. I'm gonna do wield. Oh, and down he went. I wonder if this is a doorway. Nope. Ooh, who called me a sissy? You a sissy. Ouch. Where'd that shock that come from? Mm, almost out of ammo on this. Oh man, it takes forever just to get to take these guys down. Oh, he went down. Oh, 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 no. I almost fell down. I was like trying to chase that needler and it fell down here. And <laughs> it almost fell down. That was pretty brilliant, actually. Okay, let's see if I can... Down. Oh, okay. Get my cover. Oh, shoot. I thought it was one of our guys. Oh, he... 
He died. My bad. I'm not about to die. You can't kill me. I'm a bad. <laughs> I'm thinking about that vine now, right? That was a close one, needless to say. Almost died there. Ooh, look. Yeah, there we go. Refill. Only had 50 on that. Oh, that's. I guess I don't have a squad anymore. They're all dead. See if there's anything around here. All right, hit a checkpoint. Okay, that lowered my shields greatly. Now that kind of sucks that I can't constantly use active camo. Look at him go flying. Oh man, a good, a very good hit. Hmm. Those moves look totally different from what I thought would be. I forgot what I was saying, I'm probably rambling on at this point. Picked up the plasma grenade. So I need to open up the hangar. How do I do that? Do I go through here? This doesn't look. No, 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 no. this doesn't look. Oh, so these are conveyor belts, huh? Interesting. I always appreciated the art design of Halo. There's such unique concepts, indeed. Okay, there we go. Opened up the inner bay. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. Okay. That's interesting. Most interesting. Can I? <laughs> I'm gonna land right here. All right, those look like friends. Oh shoot! They just blew up. Blew me up. Oh shoot. That was about his melee. I'm so he's killing these dudes. Is this the way forward? Nope. What's this? What is this? Oh shoot, that's like a missile launcher. I'm gonna go back to that. Alright, where do I need to go though? Nope. He's too fast for me. <laughs> I was gonna try to like sneak up and stealth behind him. I have to wait for my health bar or my stealth bar to fill up. Boom. I see why people hated needlers, more people. Oh shoot, wrong guy. 
Oh. Only have four ammo left. Oh, I guess I have to go this way. Okay, I'm out of ammo on that. Sorry, I have to check something real quick. Try and sneak up behind these guys. Oh man, that took him forever to go down. What's he shooting at? Oh no, he dead. Oh no, he got him. Oh, look at him go. Oh no. I gotta take cover. Is that a flamethrower? I got a flamethrower. There's one in a flamethrower. Okay. That's not good for my overshield. Hmm. This looks like a flamethrower. What is it called? Let's see, switch weapons real quick. Sentinel Beam. Okay, this should be fun. I wanted to see how the old graphics look real quick. Oh, the music's totally different from what it was. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. Down you go. Well, it's not fair that you guys get to go all sneaky beaky. I want to be sneaky too. Can I get out to keep reloading, waiting for it to happen? You're gonna blow up. Oh, he got sticky. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> oh. Did he at least drop? Nope, he didn't drop anything. Well, it's this little grunt and me, I guess. Let's see if we can do wield this. Oh. No, I'm definitely taking one of these. I need to swap for that. There we go. 
That's a better weapon loadout, right? Gotta yeah, take cover. That was really reckless of me. My bad. Headshot. One hit, one kill. in this room right here. Ooh. Deal okay. with him, my brothers. I will defend the Oracle. His truth must not be silent. No, he's he's taken off. Out of ammo for my energy shield. Now I get to use one of these heretic banshees. Oops. I totally forgot how to fly one of these. Been shot. Down you go. I'm just gonna go back and get it better. Got a better banshee going. I like the controls for the banshee, it's pretty interesting. Very nonchalant and very relaxed compared to other video games I play like Battlefield or something I don't know find very jarring I guess I mean there's there's definitely skill to those games just gotta remember that Halo was made with a console in mind for and first console in mind first that's what I meant to say Oh, okay, so that's how you fire the bombs. Oh, look at this art style. Oh, so that's how you do it. Okay, there you go. I like that. I like the little barrel animations. I really like the music. It's really brought it together. Goodbye. He's out of here.
Oh, so if you don't hold down the acceleration button, the Banshee just immediately just dives. This branch is about to break. I think we're gonna take a new one out. Get one of these new ones. So while you're boosting, you're not allowed to fire. That's interesting. Oh, look at him fly. Whee. There's nothing down here. Hopefully that guy doesn't get ripped apart. I like how the heads-up display for like when you're playing as Master Chief is blue, but for when you're playing as the Arbiter, it's purple. I, I don't know, it seems very fitting for some reason. It's a color scheme. <laughs> Did I get him? Yeah, I got him. <laughs> All right, all right. Oh, there's another one over here. The taste of your own medicine. Yeah. Oh, I'm surprised it didn't go down yet. Oh wow, look at that maneuver. Oh dear, I'm gonna blow up. I don't think you can go really backwards, can you? What's this? What's this? I right, got only pretty low battery on that one. Low ammo, low battery, I don't know what you have to say. And cutscene. Looks like we're in the next part. We're gonna have to end it right there. I hope you guys consider subscribing if you haven't done so already. Hit that notification bell and I'll see you guys in the next one. What is it? That stench. I've smelled it before.
what happened to you? Yeah, bad feeling about this. You always have bad feeling. You had bad feeling about morning food, Nipple. Close your jaws, or I shall bind them shut. Hold your fire! Hold your fire! I wondered who the prophets would send to silence me. An arbiter. I'm flattered. He's using a holodrome. He must be close. Come out so we may kill you. <laughs> Get in line. Stand firm. The flood.
Maintain our position. Bring the phantoms close to the mine. We are not leaving until the leader of these heretics is dead. through this, then we shall force him out. How? The cable. I'm going to cut it. Get everyone back to the ships. Warriors, return to the landing zone. The Arbiter will continue upward. Cut this station loose and scare the heretic from the hole. May our lords guide your hand. We shall not forget your sacrifice. Fight.
That's one. By the prophet, look at the state you live!
Sacrifice us all for nothing. More questions? Splendid. I would be happy to assist you. The elites are blind, Arbiter. But I will make them see.
His edification was most enjoyable. I had no choice, Holy Oracle. This heretic imperiled the Great Journey. Oracle? Great Journey? Why do you meddlers insist on using such inaccurate <laughs> That is the Oracle. So it is. Come, we are leaving this system. Key the system. Do it and find out where we are. Sorry for the quick jump, Sergeant. You in one piece? I'm good. Yeah. Chief? We're fine. Ma'am, there's an object coming into view now. Cortana, what exactly am I looking at? That is another halo. <laughs> Say what? So this is what my father found. I thought halo was some sort of super weapon. It is. If activated, this ring will cause destruction on a galactic scale. I want all the information you've got on the first halo. Schematic, topography, whatever. I don't care if I have the clearance or not. Yes, ma'am. Where's our target? The enemy ship has stopped above the ring, ma'am. We're going to pass right over it. Perfect. Given what we know about this ring, it's even more important that we capture the Prophet of Regret. Find out why he came to Earth, why he came here. Chief, take first platoon. Hard drop. Secure a landing zone. Sergeant, load up two flights of pelicans and follow them in. Aye, aye, ma'am. Until I can move and fight, I'm going to keep a low profile. Once you leave the ship, you're on your own. Understood. Over the target, in five. Hang on to your helmet.
I hear you. Starting our approach. Hang tight. Easier said than done. Inbound phantoms, Chief. up on this side of the gorge. Tries to extend the bridge to the this structure. Regarding the history of the Covenant and its glorious founding species, the San Shayum and Sanghili, the record of punished deeds would not be sufficient without a word on the Arbiter. Not the consignment of shame that it is currently, but what came before, the legendary warriors of Sanghili past. Before the Covenant, the Sanghili ruled their world with pride and vigilance, surviving the perils of both land and sea. These were the arbiters of old, 
part king, part judge, warrior rulers, unlike any of which would follow. When we arrived on their frontier world of Olgathon, the cost of life was severe. Led by a mighty arbiter, the Sangheili resisted our entreatment with ruthless force, leading to decades of war. We would eventually triumph, of course. And when we did, we would not ignore the mantle of the Arbiter. Like all things, we would bend the Sangheili to our own ends. The Arbiters would become the very will of the Prophets.
Careful, we're coming up on another structure. Hold up in the middle of this structure. We need to clear them out.
You always bring me to such nice places. Still no word about in amber clad on the coming of It's odd. The 
Covenant know we made landfall, but they don't seem to consider us a very serious threat. Boy, are they in for a big surprise. Watch yourself, honor guard. Watch yourself, honor guard. Watch yourself, honor guard. Wait, go back. That's what I thought he said. The Prophet of Regret is planning to activate Halo. Are you sure? I shall light this holy ring, release its cleansing flame, and burn a path into the divine beyond! Pretty much. Commander, we've got a problem. So I hear. But from what I understand, the Prophet will need an object, the Index, to activate the ring. I've located a library similar to the one you found on the first Halo. If the rings work the same way, the Index should be inside. I'll bet the Covenant are thinking the exact same thing. Then we better beat them to it, Sergeant. Extract your men and meet me at the library. Yes, ma'am. I'll secure the Index, Chief. You take out the Prophet. He's given us all the intel we need. built these new structures around the old to protect them, honor them. Pure speculation, mind you. I need to make a thorough survey to be sure.
Look out! Cortana, the Covenant's getting nosy. I don't want to give away my position, so I'm rerouting a few stragglers back to you. I apologize. These pelicans are all the support you're gonna get. Understood, ma'am. Gondola is launching from the far towers. Big surprise. It's full of Covenant reinforcements. This lake couldn't have been formed by volcanic action, which means it was either built this way on purpose or was created by some other cataclysmic event. I'm sorry, were you trying to kill something? Learn how to 
how to fight! Do those things even understand what you're saying? I'll tear your monkey brain! <laughs> through. Ah, now I see. There's a submerged section that connects these towers to the outlying structures. Looks like we're going down. Unless you'd prefer to swim. I've intercepted a secure transmission from Regret's carrier to something called High Charity. It seems to be a formal apology to the prophets of truth and mercy. Apparently, Regret jumped the gun when he attacked Earth. 
He's asking the other prophets to forgive his premature arrival, arguing that no human presence was foretold. That explains why there were so few ships in his fleet. But it's odd a prophet would have such bad intel about his enemy's homeworld. I've got a big head. You're making this real easy.
foes we encountered on our search were compelled to join our union. To take part in a movement that promised freedom for allegiance, salvation for service. But some, like the humans, chose to impede our progress. For generations, our holy arrangement put the prophets in charge of religion and technology. The elites led our military forces to convert new species and find relics such as your halo. And these relics you sought, the San Shayun, your prophets, told you that they would lead you on this great journey? Yes. Transcendence. Eternal life. Their promises were endless. We gave up our old ways to follow the Prophet's lead on the great journey. Gave up all of our history. All of our traditions. Not all of your traditions, it seems. This Arbiter you mentioned, hasn't that always been a position of power for your species? Power? It was long ago. An Arbiter was once the pinnacle of our people, leader of the clans, and master of the battlefield. But then, an Arbiter committed heresy, and an example was made of him. Heresy? He challenged the word of the Prophets, challenged and lost. So the title of Arbiter became a badge of shame for our most spectacularly failed warriors. Hmm, yes. They were accomplished manipulators. Back before the firing of the Array. I see at least that hasn't changed. Manipulators? What? And before? Before when? I will explain later. Right now I want you to tell me everything you can of these Arbiters. Block our access to sacred sites, damage holy relics. For their transgressions, the humans shall be hunted until none remain alive. You hear that? I'll follow. Regret's carrier just received a response from High Charity. A very well encrypted message from the Prophet of Truth. Listen to this. Your haste has jeopardized the fulfillment of our covenant, threatened our grand design. 
that you shall be spared a public display of our contempt is thanks only to mercy and his wise counsel. Truth, mercy, regret. Three prophet hierarchs. Killing regret should shake up the covenant leadership. But frankly, it sounds like you might be doing truth a favor. Chief, I'm nearly out of fuel. We've secured the first tower cluster, so I'll set down there. Call when you're ready for evac. on that thing. How's it going, you two? So far, so good. We're approaching the main temple now. 
Roger that. I'm as close to the library as I can get. There's some sort of barrier. We're trying to find a way around it. I'll keep you posted. The largest Covenant fleet I've ever seen. The largest anyone's ever seen. Get inside the temple and kill Regret before it can stop us. of phantoms. Too many for me to track. We don't have much time. There are honor guards all over this place. Watch your back. The Covenant believes on multiple waves of phantoms. Too many for me to track. We don't have much time. There are honor guards all over this place. Watch your back.
There's the target. Take him out. There's the target. Take him out. Take him out!
deflecting everything you throw at it. Get in close and do whatever you can. You shall not hide from me, demon. Ah! Phantoms are turning around. The fleet is preparing to fire on our position. We need to get out of here. Dead, Commander. His murderer was within our grasp. If you had not withdrawn our phantoms... Are you questioning my decision? No, Holy One. I only wish to express my concern that the brutes... Recommissioning the Guard was a radical step. But recent events have made it abundantly clear that the Elites can no longer guarantee our safety. I shall relay your decision to the Council. Do you know, Arbiter, the Elites have threatened to resign, to quit the High Council, because of this exchange of hats? We have always been your protectors. These are trying times for all of us. Even as the human's annihilation filled us with satisfaction, the loss of one of the Sacred Rings racked our hearts with grief. Putting aside our sorrow. We renewed our faith in the prophecy that other rings would be found, and see how our faith has been rewarded. Halo! <coughs> its divine wind will rush through the stars, propelling all who are worthy along the path to salvation. But how to start this process? For ages we searched for one who might unlock the secrets of the rings. An oracle. And with your help, we found it. With appropriate humility, we plied the Oracle with questions, and it, with clarity and grace, has shown us the key. You will journey to the surface of the ring and retrieve this sacred icon. With it, we shall fulfill our promise. Salvation for all! And begin the great journey. Well, let's the shoes down. You will head straight to the library. I do not wish to keep the Hierarchs waiting. The human that killed the Prophet of Regret. Who was it? Who do you think? The demon is here? <laughs> Why? Looking for a little payback? Retrieving the Icon is my only concern. <laughs> of course. Thank you. 
Honor to that armor arbiter. In the center of this zone is a sacred icon critical to the great journey. I must find it. We shall cut into the heart of this infestation, retrieve the icon, and burn any flood that stand in our way. The parasite is not to be trifled with. I hope you know what you're doing. Forward, warriors, and fear not pain or death. Go, officer. I'll follow when our reinforcements arrive.
It is most unusual that in all the exploits of these Arbiters, you never mention their role in choosing their missions of redemption. There is no role, Oracle. Once one of our commanders becomes an Arbiter, he belongs to the Hierarchs. These Hierarchs, they are the same High Prophets who control all the holy relics you collect from my time? The same. And they use these relics to build your new weapons and bring you the word of your gods? It has always been so. Interesting. Am I a holy relic? I... I do not understand. Because I am certainly not a god. I am a tool, as is this mining platform you stand upon, as was the installation that once orbited the planet. The Forerunner's technology is lasting and indeed quite powerful, but I'm quite certain they would have told me if I was infused with some kind of divine power. I suspect some of your prophets may have been quite aware of how much divine inspiration tools such as myself could provide. And you never question these proclamations. Even your mightiest warriors, these Arbiters, never questioned? Questioning was what brought shame to the word Arbiter long ago, Oracle. How disappointing. I fear now that there are many questions we should have been asking for a long, long time. I would be more than happy to answer any such questions. But I have a few more for you. Continue your tale of these Arbiters.
more humans. They must be after the Icon. On your way, Arbiter. I'll deal with these beasts. for an attack. gathers for an attack. Well, as expected. 
hat dort mal Gold Floyd. Check this vessel. It may be our only means of escape. You know, your father never asked me for help either. The index is secure. Mackenzie, Perez, how's our exit? You hear me, Marines? We well, got trouble. Johnson, you all right? Johnson! 
Excellent work, Arbiter. The Hierarchs will be pleased. Lycon is my responsibility. What's your responsibility? Now it is mine. A bloody fate awaits you and the rest of your incompetent race. And I, Tartarus, chieftain of the brutes, will send you to it. And the prophets learn of this, that they will take your head when they learn. <laughs> Fool. They ordered me to do it. this thing off. Demon. This one is mission and nerve. And has its mind concluded. This one is but flesh and faith. And is the more deluded. Kill me or release me, Parasite. But do not waste my time with talk. There is much talk, and I have listened through rock and metal and time. Now I shall talk, and you shall listen. Greetings. I am 2401 Penitent Tangent. I am the monitor of Installation 05. And I am the Prophet of Regret, Council of Most High, Hierarch of the Covenant. A reclaimer? Here? At last. We have much to do. This facility must be activated if we are to control this outbreak. Stay where you are. Nothing can be done until my sermon is complete. Not true. This installation has a successful utilization record of 1.2 trillion simulated in one actual. It is ready to fire on demand. Of all the objects our lords left behind, there are none so worthless as these oracles. They know nothing of the great journey! And you know nothing about containment. You have demonstrated complete disregard for even the most basic protocols. This one's containment. <laughs> and this one's great journey are the same. Your prophets have promised you freedom from a doomed existence. But you will find no salvation on this ring. Those who built this place knew what they wrought. Do not mistake their intent, or all will perish as they did before. This thing is right. Halo is a weapon. Your prophets are making a big mistake. Your ignorance already destroyed one of the sacred rings, demon. It shall not harm another. If you will not hear the truth, then I will show it to you. There is still time to stop the key from turning. But first it must be found. You will search one likely spot. And you will search another. Fate had us meet as foes, but this ring will make us brothers. We are, all of us, gravely concerned. The release of the Parasite was unexpected, unfortunate, but there is no need to panic. In truth, this is a time to rejoice. A moment that all the Covenant should savor. For the Sacred Icon has been found. With it, our path is clear, 
Our entry into the divine beyond guaranteed. The great journey is nigh, and nothing, not even the flood, can stop it. Kill the demon! Brutes! The faster you can kill those brutes, the better. They don't have shield generators, but take them out before... Demon has infiltrated the council chamber! Protect the hierarchs! Seal the exits! Oh, I don't think so. down on one of the pedestals near the door. That prophet, Truth, he has the Index. You've got to take it from him. Let me get these doors. Go, it'll be easier to track Truth if I stay in the network. Don't worry, you can pick me up later.
Watch out for the captain. He's got a brute shot. Truth is moving through the lower levels of the tower. I'll reverse this grab lift. Drop down, try to cut him off. It's safe, really. Just step in. Trolls, stay sharp. have failed to protect the profits, and in so doing put all our lives in risk. Let no warrior forget his oath. Thou and faith will keep us safe whilst we find the path. I've got a fix on truth just outside this tower, Keith. There's an exit nearby. Hurry.
Whereas most species were grafted into the covenant by faith or mutual beneficence, the Ungoi were not such. Their kind was brought into the fold by force, and it was by force that they were held captive. Their world had no prayer against our might and majesty, and their peoples were quickly laid low, many of them brought into subjugation. Yet while some species would perish under such pressure, others rise to the occasion, taking arms if need be, or fighting back. Such it was for the Ungoy when their feud with the Kigyar led to rebellion. An effort by the Kigyar to sterilize the Ungoy population was met with stiff resistance. And for a time, the holy city was thrown into chaos. Once fully provoked, the Ungoy were merciless in their violence, lashing out at all species. Their large numbers and their tenacious volatility made them a suitable challenge, even for the elites. And yet again, we turned to an arbiter. And with a ferocity unparalleled since the beginning of the Covenant, the Ungoy world would be reduced to glass. Those within the Holy City would be forced to watch, unable to stop what could have been the very end of their kind. The Ungoy Rebellion was brought to an end by the Arbiter's hand. Their world was not completely lost, and those who survived within high charity found some measure of mercy. They had proven their worth in combat, and would now serve alongside the Sangheili in battle.
small arms fire throughout their fleet. Creatures of the Covenant, the path is broad and we shall walk it side by side. Slip space rupture. It's in amber clad. Be glad. Creatures of the Covenant, the path is broad and we shall walk it side by side. <coughs> Slip space rupture. It's in amber clad. At this moment, the counselors gather on Halo to see the icon of Rise, Duck Brothers! Cast down the elites! There are those who said this day would never come. What are they to say now? Once the towers are clear, we'll drive them from the lower district.
I have listened to the Oracle, and it confirmed our deepest hope. The great journey begins with fear. The elites are falling back to the mausoleum. Fools! Their arbiter can do nothing for them now. Who would doubt the prophets? What have we thought?
If we're going to catch Truth, we'll need to take a shortcut straight through the mausoleum. Look on the bright side. For now, they seem much more interested in killing each other. On me, brother. I'm on. You might consider sitting this one out. You might consider sitting this one out.
consider sitting this one out. and find a way out of here before things get really ugly. Split them up. One in each phantom. The hopes of all the Covenant rest on your shoulders, Chieftain. My faith is strong. I will not fail. Let him be. The great journey waits for no one, brother. Not even you.
By the prophets. What have these brutes done? They have shed our brother's blood, and for that they must die. Sell it. So much for a stealthy advance. Ah, over so soon? Oh, 
I'm starting to fear that you're not very smart. Mind your tongue, Oracle. <coughs> oh, I mean no offense. I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about your species. How long have these prophets been anointing Arbiters? Since the fall of Falchavami, the first disgraced Arbiter, roughly 400 years ago. Incredible! And in all this time, it never occurred to you how convenient it was that your prophets were able to find a powerful, capable leader among your people, who happened to suddenly commit a terrible blasphemy every time the power structure of your covenant was threatened. I do not understand. Hmm, you do little to dissuade my fears. Then teach me. Looking back at the record of the Arbiters you discussed, was it not surprising to anyone that those chosen to become Arbiter were more than simple warriors? How so? Each of them had significant political influence among your people. In some cases, that influence was already being used to question the decisions of your hierarchs. In fact, that very questioning often gave rise to the charges of heresy that so neatly removed the challenger from the hierarch's concern. And once they were branded Arbiter... They promptly and quite cheerfully ran to meet their deaths. All our lives we look down at the path, put our feet where the prophets tell us. All our lives spent convincing ourselves of the truth of our covenant. Truly have been wasted. Let's hope not all of it, for we have a great deal of work to do. The Flood is still out there, so I require a cooperative reclaimer to enact proper containment procedures. But your Covenant keep trying to kill all the reclaimers I can find. All this bickering is quite a deadly waste of time. Right now, the most important question we can ask is this. Who could break this hold the Prophets have over you?
Why don't you get up? Arbiter. The counselors, are they murdered by the brutes? Fire disloyal beasts. The prophets were fools to trust them.
with us. The counselors. <laughs> Shed our brother's blood, and for that they must die. Sell it. So much for a stealthy advance. Ah, over so soon?
still live? It's gone!
I'm starting to fear that you're not very smart. Mind your tongue, Oracle. Oh, I mean no offense. I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about your species. How long have these prophets been anointing Arbiters? Since the fall of Falchavami, the first disgraced Arbiter. Roughly 400 years ago. Incredible! And in all this time, it never occurred to you how convenient it was that your prophets were able to find a powerful, capable leader among your people, who happened to suddenly commit a terrible blasphemy every time the power structure of your covenants was threatened. I do not understand. Hmm, you do little to dissuade my fears. Then teach me. Looking back at the record of the Arbiters you discussed, was it not surprising to anyone that those chosen to become Arbiter were more than simple warriors? How so? Each of them had significant political influence among your people. In some cases, that influence was already being used to question the decisions of your hierarchs. In fact, that very questioning often gave rise to the charges of heresy that so neatly removed the challenger from the hierarch's concern. And once they were branded Arbiter... They promptly and quite cheerfully ran to meet their deaths. All our lives we look down at the path, put our feet where the prophets tell us. All our lives spent convincing ourselves of the truth of our covenant. Could all of it truly have been wasted? Let's hope not all of it, for we have a great deal of work to do. The Flood is still out there, so I require a cooperative reclaimer to enact proper containment procedures. But your Covenant keep trying to kill all the reclaimers I can find. All this bickering is quite a deadly waste of time. Right now, the most important question we can ask is this. Who could break this hold the Prophets have over you?
Don't you get up? Arbiter. The counselors, are they murdered by the brutes? Fire on disloyal beasts. The prophets were fools to trust them. What is that place? Where the counselors were meant to watch the consecration of the Icon. The start of the great journey. There is still time to stop the key from turning. I must get inside. Then mount up, Arbiter. I know a way to break those doors.
hunters have come to our aid, Arbiter. They will fight by our side.
one I would trust with this information is probably dead right now. He was commander of the fleet that brought me to the system. Fel Vadimi was his name. But after hearing you tell of the destruction of the ring, I cannot believe that he still lives. His orders were to secure the ring, to prepare it for the arrival of the Hierarchs. Vadimi never fails in his duties. If the ring is no more, then Vadimi must be dead. Duty can indeed be a dangerous virtue. But even if he did live, wouldn't this sense of duty make him quite unlikely to set aside his allegiance to the Prophets? Perhaps not. And he would never betray our people. No, if I... if we were able to just speak to him, explain everything you have told me, no, these are futile hopes. If he did live, and if he was returned to the High Prophets, they would most certainly punish him for the destruction of the Ring. In fact, he would be the exact kind of leader the Hierarchs would make Arbiter. They would need someone to blame for the loss of the Ring. His influence within the fleet grew with every one of his victories over the humans. And if he did become Arbiter? Then he would be lost to our cause. Without the knowledge you've shared with me, he would obey the prophets without question. I doubt he would even respond to his former name. <clears throat> I don't know what it would take to overcome, but as you say, we don't have time to ask such questions, and Vadimi is almost certainly dead. If all your hopes rest on him, then I fear for the future of this galaxy. As do I, Oracle. As do I. But I will begin our fight. Make others aware of the lies the Prophets whisper in our ears. And soon, we will find more who will take up our cause. We don't do something, Mr. Mohawk's gonna activate this ring, and we're all gonna die. Tartarus has locked himself inside the control room. Well, I just happen to have a key. Come on, grab a banshee and give me some cover. Gonna know what's coming.
This reclaimer is delicate. One more word, Oracle, and I'll rip your eye from its socket! Mm. Which is nothing compared to what I'll do to you. Tartarus, stop. Mm. Impossible. Put down the icon. Put it down, and disobey the Hierarchs? There are things about Halo even the Hierarchs do not understand. <laughs> Take care, Arbiter. What you say is heresy. Is it? Oracle, what is Halo's purpose? Collective no! of the Seven. Not another word. Please. Don't shake the light bulb. If you want to keep your brain inside your head, I tell those boys to chill. <coughs> Go ahead. Do your thing. The sacred rings, what are they? Weapons of last resort, built by the Forerunners to eliminate potential flood hosts, thereby rendering the Parasite harmless. And those who made the rings? What happened to the Forerunners? After exhausting every other strategic option, my creators activated the rings. They and all additional sentient life in three radii of the Galactic Center died as planned. Would you like to see the relevant data? Tartarus, the Prophets have betrayed us. No, Arbiter! The Great Journey has begun, and the Brutes, not the Elite, shall be the Prophet's escort! Oh! 
What's that? A beacon. What's it doing? Communicating at superluminal speeds with the frequency Communicating of... with what? The other installations. Show me. Failsafe protocol. In the event of unexpected shutdown, the entire system will move to standby status. All remaining platforms are now ready for remote activation. Remote activation? From here? Don't be ridiculous. Listen, Tinkerbell, don't make me... Then where? Where would someone go to activate the other rings? Why the Ark, of course. And where, Oracle, is that? We've got a new contact, unknown classification. It isn't one of ours. Take it out. This is Spartan 117. Anyone hear me? Over. Isolate that signal. Master Chief? You mind telling me what you're doing on that ship? Sir, finishing this fight. Alright. 
shoot. 